Cam, Cam. You okay? Well, we reckon gonna find it. I've been watching too much of it. <laughs> day routine I actually have some braids in that I've had in for like a month and a half now so I'm gonna take these out and then show you guys my wash routine um, my routine is actually pretty simple um, I've, over the years I feel like I've been struggling with okay like what is my hair like what am I supposed to do with my, with my natural hair that like everyone else is doing everyone else is trying this and that and it's like I'm Kim Kim please and I'm so confused so over the years, I kind of learned that my hair doesn't take much to grow and be fine. Um, if I just leave it alone, don't style it too much, just keep it moisturized, it's fine, you know. So, and um, right now, I've been using some products I'll show you guys in my routine that I've been working for me um, lately. So, yeah. Okay, so I'm just taking out my braids and then we'll get into it. It's my danger. Whenever we go out, John Jacob Jinga. And um, I have a tutorial on how I did these braids. Um, I'm, I already have it up on my channel, so I'll link it on the screen and down below if you're interested. It's fake Body smoking like a cigarette. Oh, oh, ah, baby, I can smoke it all. Yeah. Say now you, I want to see when I wake up in the morning. All right, so my hair is all nice and detangled and ready for washing. Baby, make you ginger, and I go ginger. Ah, I know that you're feeling me, and I be feeling. And I like to twist my hair up before I shampoo so I can make sure that I get every section and um, it helps keep my hair nice and stretched for washing and I got my Pattern Beauty shampoo and conditioner me I feel to turn them down anywhere we go see them my hair is washed just drying it a little bit more before I go and blow dry it Alright, so my friend Oluchi is actually launching a hair care line and I have a sample of her um, hair butter. So I'm going to use it on my hair. Anyways, I, I, I've, I've been trying um, the Pattern Beauty for some months now and um, I've been using it consistently so I can really gauge like does my hair really like it? Do I really like it? Or am I being biased? You know, because I'm not, I'm not like the best at knowing like, oh, okay, this product is good for my hair. This product is not, you know what I mean? But I feel like I can tell when my hair likes something because my hair is really soft. The curl, my curls are very defined and um, my hair just stays moisturized longer. You know what I mean? Without having to, you know, without trying so much. But yeah, I like the way, like my hair is so soft. It's so bouncy and my curls are defined and stuff. Like I can see my curls and stuff, so. That's how I can kind of tell, like, you know, if my hair likes. But yeah, but my hair loves Pattern Beauty. I've been try using it for some months now, and I can definitely say that my hair definitely, definitely likes it. So, all right, so I actually um, blow dry my hair in four sections. I put the hair butter on each section right before dry it but yeah my hair is so so good so this is the brush I use to further detangle before I dry my hair I got this on Amazon I'll link um, down below but I like it because it's very good at detangling hair without putting so much tension on your natural hair because the hair the, the brush is in um, sections so I love this brush so much <laughs> Okay, and then this is a hair dryer that I'll be using. And I've shown this hair dryer many times before, and 
my videos um, but I'll link it down below um, I got it off Amazon and I love 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 it just trying to figure out where I can plug this in <laughs> See them let me hating now She carry you, she carry you Her body amazing oh. My baby, my baby yo oh. I go love you forever oh. Girl for your body, I'm a risk it I'm a risk it Hair is dry My lips are dry, my face is dry because I need lotion But we're not gonna talk about that My hair is nice and dry So after I dry a section, I twist it off so that um, I can keep it as stretched as possible so this is how it looks when I've dried it and then put it in the sections. But this is my hair. Nice and washed and dried and detangled. I love it. Yeah, I love this dryer brush. Like it gets your hair very, very, very well. Very, very well. All right. There's my hair. And my edges are kind of sparse from postpartum shedding. Um, but um, I have a cream that my mother-in-law gave me from Nigeria that I've been putting on my edges so I can grow back. So that's what we're working with now. Yeah, my hair is so nice and soft. I love it. Alright, so my hair is very, very moisturized and soft. Oh, I love it. Nice and flowy. I love it. So that is my wash day routine. It's actually very easy and simple. Um, I like to keep it simple because um, I don't have time to be like, you know, doing too much, doing the most. I have a child, I have things to do. So I like to keep it very simple and I feel like my hair grows, has grown the most and the best with this routine that I've kind of packed down. It's very easy, but um, as I continue to do it, I notice a difference in my hair and retaining length and just being healthy overall. Um, what else did I want to say? Um, probably, I'll probably trim my ends soon. The last time I trimmed them, <sighs> when was that when was that what is it it's mar it's april right now i think i trimmed in either december or january so i'll probably trim soon again but as i said my edges if we will come back in you can kind of see how they're kind of sparse but um yeah so that's my simple and easy wash the routine for 4c hair um i will link my friends um hair butter um info down below i think she should be launching very soon and um all the products that i use i'll link it down below and i think that's it um i don't know what i have planned for my hair to style it um but i have but right now what i usually do and i have a video on how i did this like my um, milkmaid twist that i do i'll probably just do that right now before like when i turn off my camera um but i have a video on how i do that and I'll link it down below. I'll show a picture of it and stuff like that. But I'll just do that until I figure out what style I want to do for my hair right now for maintenance. But um, usually I always keep my hair braided up um, under wigs or just, you know, in a puff or just braided down. Um, and I've noticed that just doing the least amount to my hair, I get the most growth and the most retention. So I think like that's my thing. Like. I may not be like a, trying all these different like natural hairstyles and doing this and doing that and doing that. In my mind, I want to do it, but then realistically, I'm just like, you know, I think I know like what works for me. And the only styling that works for me that like I've been doing, you know, for the past couple of years is like high puffs. High puffs. They work for me. They're easy. They're good. And then braid up my hair back down again, wear some wigs, you know. So I think that's just my thing. And then now I'm doing these, um, milkmaid twist so i think that's like a new style i've added so yeah so anyways i said keeping it simple and good so anyways stop rambling see you in my next video bye
body smoking like a cigarette. Oh, oh. ah, baby, I can smoke it. Hey, ah. Say now you, I want to see when I wake up in the morning.